Good morning everyone. Today is not an at home video. Today is a I'm off to somewhere. You know where I'm going. I'm always going there at the moment so I'm not going to tell you where I'm going. No I am. We're going to Paris. We're going with L'Oreal. We're going for their collaboration with Karl Lagerfeld and this is a bit of a different trip for L'Oreal. It's really exciting. Usually we go and it's like literally a day trip or an overnight. We're doing two nights in Paris with L'Oreal and we also have like our plus ones as well which is something that we don't usually have. So we've got our, well I've got Ali coming with me and I don't actually know who else is going on this trip, it's so weird. I think Vic is gonna be there and Alex obviously. I don't know anyone else, I don't know. So hopefully some of the other girls that I obviously like love will be there, hopefully. But yeah, so I'm literally just packing up and I'm gonna show you my, my outfit is killer today. I'm sorry, this might be, I've peaked. This is my best outfit ever, 100%. <laughs> You might have already seen this t-shirt on my Instagram. If I, if I put it up, I'll insert a picture, but you'll see it there. I think our car is almost here, so I'm going to show you my outfit, finish packing, and get on my merry way, basically. So, this outfit is a bit different. Well, it's a bit of a suit, so I've got my Sophia, I don't know how you say it, God's sake, trousers on, these are like flared, High, flared, flared high-waisted trousers and I'm wearing those and I've got my totem blazer on which obviously makes this look like a really sort of cool trouser suit with flares but yeah an oversized blazer so it's like I'm kind of like chic in the street but what you don't know what you don't know is underneath <gasps> I've got a wham t-shirt on and my inner love of George Michael is fully on show and I literally don't care. I love that man so much. So <laughs> this is my outfit to go. I've obviously got my Bottega Veneta bag and I'm wearing some black Manolo Blahnik BBs because they're comfortable. Hair is in a bun because I ran out of tan and I need to still pack my suitcase. So let's get cracking. I'm also taking this with me. I'm hoping I'm allowed to show you this because this one's still hot. So I'm gonna be taking with me also the new GHD Platinum Plus Styler from the Royal Dynasty Collection. Oh my goodness. This is like the most gorgeous Christmas gift ever. Look at this box that it comes in. Perfect for traveling but also just super snazzy. So I'm gonna pop this in my suitcase, take it with me as well, it's gorgeous. It goes with my bag. I could literally use this as an accessory, but I'm gonna pop it in my bag and get going because I need to stop rambling on at you about straighteners and stuff like that, so let go. <laughs> Did I just film me, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I'll do it, come on. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I didn't realise you were bringing bricks and mortar with you. <laughs> we have just arrived in Paris. Oh yeah, we've got TVs. How cool. Oh, you oh you thank please? you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I love free water. Cool. Even though we get free water in the UK, coming out the tap. <laughs> I might look a little bit tired because I just fell asleep on the train and I also fell asleep on my jacket, which now has makeup all over my shoulder, which is not a good look considering we are now heading not to the hotel. We are heading straight to Karl Lagerfeld's studio, I believe, or workshop. Ooh. So we're heading straight there. I think we're gonna meet everyone else. And tonight we're having dinner at Lavenue, which I love. Is that, although I don't think I've ever had dinner there. I think I've like been there for lunch. Well, usually I would go to Hotel Cost for dinner, but I would love to go to Lavenue for dinner. So that's very, very exciting. <laughs> Put my seatbelt on, safety first. But yeah, hopefully I don't look too tired. I just really need to sort out these makeup marks on my jacket. I was literally one of those people that was going. Anyway. <laughs> Young and feminine. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
I am trying not to fall over something in front of me, but am I in focus? Am I in focus? Or is Vicky in focus? No, it's me. We've just arrived here at the apartment and the headquarters for Carla and we're going to be playing with some of the pieces from the, the beauty collaboration that they've been doing. And I think they brought their labs here, that's what they're saying, so we're going to get a chance to actually play with the colours and test them out. But we've just had a little talk with um, some of the people from L'Oreal and some of the people from the brand and it's been very, very interesting. I feel like I've like just got here and yet we've learned so much already. So we've just finished off making our own shade. We were only using these three colours though, so it's quite interesting that you can get like the perfect nude from just using four colours, although I actually haven't used four. I only used these three here. I would never have thought that I would need to use black though. How interesting. But I'm livid. We don't get to take it home, so I've like spent all of this time creating the most perfect nude ever for my lips, and I can't take it, but... We have been given this limited edition one that they've been working on today here in the labs and this is like there's only like 200 of these made so we do get to take this home we're not going home empty-handed guys don't worry this is really hard one-handed as well Ooh, okay i screwed that up <laughs> Oh, one of those. I hate that. I hate pretend balconies. They upset me a lot. We've just got to the room and obviously in true L'Oreal style, they have kitted the room out with Kit Kats and Harry Boat. No, I'm joking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They've kitted the room out. Yeah. <laughs> there is Harry Boat, babe. You can live your best life. You can have them both, babe. You do no, you, boo. So I'm gonna go for the Crocker. Actually, no, do you know what? I'm gonna go for Happy Cola. Happy Cola? You be Happy Cola. Well, I prefer to have those crisps, but... Why don't you have them, then? We're going for dinner now, aren't we? Look, you could even have a protein shake. I'm going for the materials. Okay, you no, go for the materials. Okay, so we are kitted out to the max with some new L'Oreal pieces. Obviously, Hydrogenius, something that I love. In fact, these are a lot of the things I love. I haven't tried these eyeliners, though, but Hydrogenius Elnet, of course. I've not tried these. Oh, there's our luggage. Oh, oh, we're blurry, we're blurry. Back in the room, come on. Come on, find me, camera, find me! There we are. Okay, as I was showing you, although we've got two, babe, you've got your own set of L'Oreal stuff. Look, they're duplicates. You are so lucky. Uh -huh. You've got all of the lipsticks and all of the eyeshadows that you could ever want. Mm, perfect. Is this your shade? We're in a really funny mood today, aren't we? Oh, that's my shade, babe. Get, get off. <laughs> oh, that one up then. Bosh, happy about that. Oh, dropping crisps. Bosh, happy about okay, that. you've just wrecked the place. You just can't take you anywhere. As I was saying, this is the room. We're staying at the W, and actually this is a much nicer room than when I stayed here last time. Last time my room was so dark, I could not do anything. But this is a little... TV unit here, then we've got the bed through here. Another fake balcony, unfortunately, but you know. Oh my God, there's two TVs. <gasps> That's a snazzy meatball. And then this is the bathroom. There is me, because we always have to show me in the bathroom mirror in all of my vlogs. Because you know, that's how it goes. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry to say, but the W Hotel gets a mirror rating of zero for ability to show outfit not to mention this light is killing it but it's not the best i can't get far enough back to even show you because the bed's here but i'm just wearing my stella mccartney trousers with a zara bodysuit which is just like standard at the moment and then just in case i get cold i've got my totem blazer on and bottega shoes and bottega bag little clutchy clutch these will all be linked down below just to show you with 
out the jacket, although that is quite handy, <laughs> being able to just take my jacket off like that. Yeah, this is what I'll probably just wear when we're in the restaurant. We're going to Lavenue tonight, and I've just gone for a simple black outfit. I did want to show you my makeup though, but I can't show you it in this mirror because it's no favours. No, no, no. I don't know if you can see it a little bit better, but hair-wise, I've gone for slick behind my ears, and I've used like half a can of Elnet just to secure that in place, but it means it's like super off my face and just smooth and minimal. Lipstick wise, not minimal. I've got these lipsticks in my room. You'd have seen them when I showed you around the room earlier. And I don't even know what this collection is, but it's the Colorish Ultra Matte. I have a mixture of no lies, no obstacles, and no doubt. And I, I mean, to be honest, I don't know if I like it because it's three lipsticks. So I don't know which one I actually like, but together they're great. So this is what we are going with for this evening. And then I've got a little bit of the By Terry CC powder in Sunny Flash on my eyes mixed with the Dior Amber Neutrals, Amber Nudes, Amber something palette that I got in Cannes. So that's my makeup for the evening. And sorry that the mirror situation is just pretty crap in here. <laughs> I'm really hoping that this music doesn't set off a YouTube copyright claim. Sorry, my hair looked like a world record egg there. I didn't vlog a single thing tonight because I did not stop bloody talking. Me and Vic, when we get together, and Ali and Alex, when they get together, it is literally like, meh, 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 meh. <laughs> we literally just don't shut up. And I didn't vlog at all. But the boys are actually having a nightcap downstairs, but Vic's got to be up early in the morning, so that we've come to bed. But the only thing is, we're not getting any bloody sleep. I can't believe the music outside. It's ridiculous. It's like I'm at a rave. It is there, like literally across the road. I'm staying in the W Hotel. This is not how we do things in the countryside, guys, okay? I live in the middle of nowhere. This is, a, no, this is a big, a, a big no from me. <laughs> this, my grandma self, can't deal with this. What song are we playing now? We've had a bit of Tom Jones, Sex Bomb. What else we had? Oh, a bit of Dua Lipa. No, this is, this is not the one. I'm literally livid, I'm so livid. <laughs> just wanna go to sleep. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna try and be better at vlogging. Why do I look like I'm still wearing mascara as well? But yeah, I'm gonna try and be better at vlogging tomorrow. We went to Lavenue and it was lovely, although the pavlova was not good. I rave about the pavlova at Lavenue, but tonight it was not good. Sorry guys, my dinner was lovely. I had the tuna tata and the vegan curry, but the pavlova was not gooey enough, it was not chewy enough, and it was just dry. It was as bad as my wedding pavlova. I had pavlova at my wedding and I did not love it at all. And it was just like that one, it was just dry and bleh. So yeah, I didn't I didn't eat it. But I did have some wine. I had some Miraval with Vic and I think the boys had some gin and tonics. But yeah, it was really good fun. Chatting house stuff, chatting work, it was great. <laughs> And we're just so funny, we've got such similar taste in things that we'll be like, oh, I got this thing the other day. And I'll be like, look, I, I, it was like funny. I was like, oh, I got these trousers. I think you'll really like them. And I show them to him. She's like, I've got those trousers. And we're like, fuck's sake. <laughs> Literally like so similar. But it's such a good evening. Really, really good evening. So anyway, I'm going to probably try and get some sleep, but fail miserably. So uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. Morning, everyone. I have literally actually been up for ages. Basically, we're going to the Ely Saab show today. And then I have to go straight from that to the L'Oreal show and like cocktails and party and dinner and stuff like that. So my look has to be quite, I want it to be impactful but also transition from day to night quite well. So I haven't actually decided what trousers I'm wearing just yet, but I've got my top sorted, but we're gonna do my makeup now. We're gonna do like quite cat eyes and keep my skin looking quite fresh. I've got my base on at the moment, but I've gone really like natural. So yeah, I'm excited. Right guys, what do you think? Do you like my makeup? Do you like my hair? I hope you do because I did it myself. <laughs> so I hope you like it because I'm like wearing my skin a lot more natural at the moment, I decided to go for a really natural highlight and I really like it. I've got a mix of about eight million lipsticks teamed with concealer on my lips and then I've got the Dior Amber Neutrals palette on my eyes. And I totally steal the Nikki makeup 
trick of the lighter eyeliner in the waterline i love it totally opens up the eye i love it and then i've like slick ricked my hair again but this time it's a little bit more secure and i've got exposed curvy grips which is good so yeah and i'll show you my outfit as well i haven't got my rings on oh kick that shoe out of the way i was trying to decide what shoes to wear because i've just been fake tanning but outfit is I'm literally, I'm wearing High Street to Fashion Week. <laughs> this is why I don't do Fashion Week, okay? I've got H&M trousers on, hold on, let me brighten you up. Okay, hopefully you can see that a little bit better. I've got H&M Conscious trousers on. These are like a, they're quite shiny, but I just love this pleat down the front that unfortunately you can't see. Hopefully Ali can show you later. Then I've got this, this is like an, a lingerie piece. It's a, actually a dress, but I just roll it up. And it's kind of like my the sirens in Paris. <laughs> The moldy sirens as me and Carrie call them. It's kind of similar to my wedding basque that I wore, but it's just really flattering. It's really tight in here, so it sits like, it hugs your lady lumps quite nicely. And it just means that you keep a nice silhouette, especially when you're wearing a top that's like this, that sort of is a bit floofy. This is my 15 pound nasty gal top that I found and purchased just in time for this trip. And then I've popped it with some Bottega Veneta shoes. And I think I'm gonna take the bag as well, but yeah, all black, all black, no color apart from in my soul. But yeah, I feel comfortable and I think that that's the main thing for me is that I just never feel comfortable with these things and I always feel like I'm like, if I'm trying too hard, it just, I don't enjoy it. So black trousers and a cute little 15 pound top and ugh, I'm laughing. I was going to wear flares with it, but Ali says he prefers these trousers. So we're going with something a little bit more androgynous, which I really like. Perfume is Amber Musk as well, of course. And hair I done with the new GHD Dynasty straightener which i've been using the um platinum plus styler all the time but this one it just i don't know it seems like it's making it smoother i don't know maybe i'm gonna ask the girls if there's been any change in the technology that i don't know about but my hair feels so smooth i love it and i also love that it's pink but anyway i should be getting ready to go so i'm going to finish off my red bowl and then i'm going to head downstairs Do everything that i could want make me feel so We have just finished up at the Ely Star Show and we are now in the chicest pet shop, quite literally, in France. Look at this. I want to get all of the stuff for Lumi. It's also making me want to cry a little bit, but still, it doesn't matter. And the little puppy. Hi. Hello. Welcome to your YouTube debut. Hi. Hi. Are you so chic? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah, I think you need a dog. And I'll look after it when you're traveling. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> trying to get Vic to get a dog. <laughs> I'm sorry, you Actually, Lumi gets on better with dogs than she does other cats. Really? Yeah. A great pet. Exactly. So, so get the okay. dog. <laughs> We're a bit early to the L'Oreal show, so we've come to get a coffee in this little cafe. Here. Try not to get all the other people in. We're going to get. Um, Copies, and then we're gonna go to the show. We're waiting for the boys to come and meet us and just have a really great evening. So, we have just arrived to the show. Oh, look at this guy! Is it, is it, I think someone just told me this guy's got you got a new backpack. 
<laughs> you got a new backpack? You got a new Look backpack? Big Mel Shy. Look how cute this is. You're going to find me back. <laughs> You're such a sad spot. <laughs> we've just arrived to the L'Oreal show and we've got our seats. We've got like the best seats. We've got all the gang here. Look, we've got Sophie, Manal, Vic, Alex. Ali's somewhere. Ali's I don't somewhere. know where. Oh, there he is. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> this is going to be his, his show. <laughs> but look how amazing this is. Oh, this is beautiful. Wow. And look at the sky. So perfect. Perfect, perfect. We are sat waiting for the show to start and Vic's idea to do is check the menu of the place that we're going before so that we know what food is coming. I, I love a girl who's prepared. Oh, I love oh, this. Wait, I right. found it as well. What is it? We're going to La Societe. Have you been there before? No. I feel no. like I'm interviewing you. But I mean, I'm really hoping they've got pasta or pizza and gin. Oh, did gins tonight. We did wine last night. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, we're on the gins tonight. On the gins tonight. Absolutely. If they've got pizza and pasta. Oh, there's, there's a great gluten free place in, in Paris that Carrie and I went to for pizza and pasta. Really? All, all gluten free? All gluten free. Everything. Everything. What's it called? I can't remember. I have to text Carrie. But it's really good. I'll, I'll get it. I'll, I'll text. It was in one of my videos. If you guys want to know, it's in my Paris video when I got stuck in Paris with Carrie for the Buy Terry shoot. It's in that video. Uh, that wasn't my phone. My dad says that about his sister all the time, yeah. Tea leaf. Thief. Oh, it's Oh, is it? This is the second night in the row that these two are going for a nightcap. But, but tonight, they've lumbered Vic and I with their backpacks. So we're taking them back to the room to get some sleep. So they can have, a, what's your Cockney rhyming slang for whiskey? They're going for a, a gold watch, which is Cockney rhyming slang for cock, scotch. <laughs> <laughs> not for cocks, not for cocks. That's not, the, that's not what it is. Right. Yes, yeah, so they're going for a frisky whiskey. whiskey. Oh. A frisky whiskey. It's gonna be no cocktail. So it's gonna be no cocktail. Risky cocktail. Anyway, I think it's just edit this whole thing out. <laughs> no, no, like this is gold. This is why I vlog. Okay. This is why I vlog. Good morning, everyone. It is our last day here. Well, it's actually not our last day. We're leaving literally now. I thought I'd show you my outfit quickly. I've got a Versace t-shirt on, Stella McCartney trousers, acne cardigan, Dior bag, and Dior shoes. We're just. Show you something. What? Come stand here. Yeah. I can show them your whole outfit. Oh, you're so snazzy. Uh, why am I not as snazzy as you? Oh, babe, you've showed me how to do it when we're leaving. 
thing. Yeah, I thought of it yesterday, but. Oh, well, here you go. First full length outfit from the trip. I look so short. <laughs> I look so dumpy, but I've got a cozy cardigan on and I've literally just done a little bit of concealer and a little bit of tinted moisturiser on my face because I really can't be bothered to make an effort today. I've had a great time and a great trip and I'm a little bit tired, but my skin is looking good. So Annie's making a massive noise in the background. You're such a dick. <laughs> We're going to head downstairs and meet the girls now. I don't know if I'll vlog anymore. I'm not sure. Well, I might chat to you. You never know. If not, then this is the end of the vlog. I should do this more often. Leave it open so I can vlog if I want to. Anyway, thank you for joining me. If I'm still going after this, then you know what happened. And us snazzy meatballs are going to the Eurostar. Bye! We have just made it home. What is the time? I don't even know what the time is. My watch is wrong. Oh, my phone's downstairs. I think it's about two or three o'clock, I'm not sure. I'm probably looking quite sleepy because I always do after I travel, even though I'm not sleepy. I'm looking forward to having a cozy night in. I'm gonna go around and light all the candles. We're gonna light the fire and we're gonna watch TV all evening and do nothing because we haven't had a weekend at all. It's Sunday, by the way, so we left on Friday and we've been working all weekend. Lots of lovely work, but it was still being on so i'm gonna get into some cozy clothes now i'm also gonna do a bit of unpacking we're gonna have dinner and it's just gonna be so nice i've literally not even got my trousers done up because i'm so ready to get into cozy clothes and i've arrived home to a huge three boxes from intimissimi and i think that this is their cozy, comfy, loveliness collection. So I'm gonna open those and see what I've got. Mr. Mill and Gordon is bringing out my suitcase and some washing. Oh yes. And we're gonna get snuggly, aren't we? Oh yes. Are you excited for the snuggle? I am, I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry too. Let me get these open and see what we've got. I'm gonna pop you there. I'm gonna do up my trousers though because that is not a look that I need to put Tom the web. Right, look at this box, it's so cute. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, what do we have in this one? Now I think this is all of like their cashmere stuff. It could just be tops at this stage, but we'll find out inside. Oh, I love a good box. Oh, lovely. Oh wow, these are stuff that you could like wear day to day. So they're quite like, they're like layering tops. Oh wow, yeah, I'd actually wear these like not just for coziness. This is like a really good basic Roll neck, I love that. I love this color. <gasps> okay, there's, a, oh, this isn't roll neck either. This is like a, oh, cute. Okay, I cannot wear that because that is such a good color. I have to save that one for best. <laughs> oh, I love this, dear Lydia. The next round of G&Ts are on you. Love, David, and oh, <laughs> I love that. Okay, we've got some camis, gorgeous camis. Oh. Oh, silk. Oh, do you know what? Again, I probably wear this in, in real life, just day to day rather than for sleeping in. But a lovely silk, 100% silk cami in black. We've got a gorgeous ivory one. Oh, well, yeah, definitely wear that as well. Then we have more tops. Again, I probably wear, I just wear these normally. These are too nice to wear as cozy clothes. Oh, Okay, this is actually ridiculous. These are so nice. These are some sort of like smart tracksuit bottoms, but these are way too nice to wear around the house. This is ridiculous. Let me move it over. There you go. You can probably see better. Lamini, you come back in. Lulu. So we've kind of got repeats of the other ones. This is sort of like a blush mull color. Got lots more of these like really nice basic tops. I'd probably wear that one around the house because it'd probably be a bit low cut for, for me to wear out. Got some greys. These are great. If you think about like under blazers and stuff, so soft as well. I think this is, these are cashmere pieces. Yeah, I think these are all their cashmere pieces. And then we've got a black roll neck. That will get so much wear. I love a good black roll neck. And then this is one that I could definitely wear around the house. I might pop this one on now. And then we've got another little cami. So that's just the first box, wow. Let's have a look what's in this one. Oh my goodness, there's even more. Wowzers, okay, <laughs> this is crazy. I can't believe how much there is. Oh, this is so nice. So this is like a soft cami, 
but with lace, like nude lace trim around it. That's really nice. We have black. We have black in the smart joggers. I love these. I'm gonna wear these now. They are getting worn. And we've got them in tan. Amazing. We've got some leggings in here. More basics. Okay, wow, this is an actual basic vest. Love this. Love, love, love. Got a little blue one in here. This is like the quickest haul I've ever done in my life, by the way, but you know, I just wanna get into my cozy clothes now. And then we've got another box, which is just as heavy. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so much stuff, wow. Oh, black, little black cashmere cardigan. Right, okay guys, I literally can't go through all of this with you because there is so much stuff, but you're gonna see more and more of this being worn in my lovely, comfy, cozy home. But I'm gonna try on these tracksuit bottoms first because they are beaut. Just to show you what I decided to put on for a cozy evening, I've popped on those trousers, which I love because they actually kind of look like trousers. They don't look like jogging bottoms. So they're a little bit smarter, but they're still super comfy and cropped as well. I love me a crop. I wonder if they come in a smaller size though. I might ask them because this is the small and I reckon I could take a size down, but I'll see. And then I've popped one of the long sleeve tops on. This is a black one with a slash neck and it just fits really nicely. This would be really great for winter, putting under jackets and blazers and just layering up as well, but also cozying around the house. I have a huge pile of stuff that I need to fold and put away now and also unpack, so I'm gonna do that. Good morning, everyone. I left you. Uh, you know when your lipstick goes funny? That's what just happened. I left you, I think, when I was getting into my cozy clothes ready for the evening and I just, I got, sorry, I just walked up the stairs. So unfit. I really got into the zone with organizing that the new cozy clothes really did put me in the zone. So I ended up organizing my cozy cupboard. As you can see there, everything is all nice and folded. I had a clear out as well. I've also been organizing all of my gym kit, my underwear. I'm still putting some bits away now, so I'm just gonna get everything put away. At the moment, really, really happy with how organized everything is in here. So I'm getting closer to doing a tour of this room. The only thing that I'm thinking about doing at the moment is I really want to change these bar stools. I want something whiter. I'd love some white linen to match this like little buffet system that I have here. And I just feel like the it's too grave in this room. I'd like something different. I also want to change the light. I've spoken about this before. I want to have some warmer tones in here and I definitely, definitely want to change these handles. I really, really don't like these handles at all. I didn't like them in the beginning. If you don't remember, I think I might have told you that I wasn't able to choose the handles. They just didn't, they didn't offer me that for some reason. And I had to like panic choose them on the day. And I just find these like circles just really like not my vibe at all. I want something a bit more traditional. I just don't know what to go for, but I want something that's got some warmer tones to them. So I'm currently looking for that. I might also try and get that replaced as well, my radiator vent. But yeah, there's just some changes that I'm gonna be doing in here. But I thought that I would like sign off the vlog because I'm ready to start a new vlog today. And I have basically done a really, really big online order of like accessories, but also organizational things and I'm going to be organizing some of the other drawers that I obviously didn't just show you in to get things a little bit more smart in here and easy to use that's something that I haven't had the time to do and I just had this weird like need to get more organized in here the other day when I got back so that's what I did I placed a big big Amazon order and I've done a Zara home order so there's going to be lots of bits kind of trickling in this week so make sure you do come back and watch my next vlog because it's obviously going to be at home and there's going to be Lots of stuff getting unboxed and organized in my house. So other than that, I will leave you here and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed coming on our trip with us. I had such a great time, both Ali and I did. Like, it's always just so, so lovely spending time with Alex and Vic. We had such a great time. It really, really, really was lovely. I enjoyed it so much. So yeah, other than that, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.